Well, it's pretty fatuous, if you don't mind me saying so. Must be lunchtime. My leg's gone to sleep. Oh, she's off to have a couple of drinks before lunch. Poor girl. She's had no happiness in her life. Meaningless words, Your Excellency. You speak like a man who's had everything he wants. Is there anything more boring in this pure country of boredom? It's hot, it's sleepy, no one's doing anything. Everyone's sounding off their pet theories. It's nice to be with you, my friends. I enjoy listening to you. But to be sitting in a hotel room, learning my lines, what could be better? Oh, I know exactly what you mean. Of course, you are better off in town. You sit at your study, the footman lets no one in unannounced. You have your telephones, your cabs in the street, and all that sort of thing. Look at the flowers on your side. Tell her that should be my friend. Here they are. My dear lady, my mother tells me you're intending to go to town with your name. Is that correct? Yes, it is. Well, if you don't mind my asking, how are we intending to get there? All of our workmen are busy today regarding the ride. How, which horses are you intending to use? Which horses? How should I know which horses? We do have carriage horses. Carriage horses? Where can I get harnesses for carriage horses? Where can I get the harnesses? <laughs> my dear lady, I'm in awe of your talent and I'm willing to give 10 years of my life to you, but please, don't ask me for horses. But what if I had to go? Oh, this is just bizarre. You don't understand the meaning of farming for years. Oh, don't start that again. If that's the way I look, then I shall leave for Moscow today. Order me horses from the village, or I shall walk to the station. Well, if that's the case, then I resign. Find someone else to manage your estate. It's the same way every summer. Every summer I come here, and they insult me. I have never set me foot in this place again. The effrontery. What is going on around here? You know, I am absolutely sick and tired of it. I want every single carriage horse brought here immediately. Refusing Irina like that. She's a famous actress. Surely any wish of her, even, even if it's of the merest whim, is far more important than anything to do with farming. What am I supposed to do? Put yourself in my position. What am I supposed to do? Let's all go look for my sister and we'll plead with her not to be. Terrible woman, tyrant. Here, here, don't get up. We'll help you. This is terrible. Yes, this is terrible, but she won't resign. I'll have a word with her in a minute. Uh. Aren't people boring? Byrax, your daughter should be thrown out on her ear. But all that will happen is Petrusha, the old woman that she is, what I'm apologizing to her. You'll see. It's because she sent the carriage horses out into the fields as well. Every day there are these other people. If only you understood how much they upset me. They're making me ill. Look, I'm shaking all over. I can't bear her being so rude. Dorn, darling, I love. We can live with you. Time passing. We're not young anymore. And if only at the end of our lives we could stop having to hide and tell lies. I'm 55 years old. It's too late to go change my life. I know why you're refusing me. It's because of all the other women you're close to. You can't ask them all to come and live with you. I know that. I'm sorry, I'm boring. Have you been with Irina all morning? I have to be somewhere. I'm tormented by jealousy. You must be tired of me. Not at all. Of course. Your doctor, you, you avoid him. I know that. But I wish you understood how awful it makes me feel. If you have to spend time with other women, can't you at least keep it out of my sight? I'll try my best. How is everything inside? Oh, Irina's crying and Patricia's having an asthma attack. I better go in and give them all valeria drops. These are for you. Oh. I'll see the end. Oh, gorgeous. Lazarus, give me those flowers. Give me those flowers! <laughs> 